Welcome back to the Big Screen Boys Podcast. My name is Mason Knight. Sitting across me is the one and only Cash Krause. But before we begin, if you guys can please be sure to smash the like button, comment below, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell notification as we drop videos here every single week. So with that said, Cash, what are we reacting to today? Well, we are a little late to the game, but we're here nonetheless. We, we always are. Um, Mandalorian Season 3 official trailer dropped. Yeah. It's going. Uh, it's out. And I'm excited for it. I'm uh, very excited for it. This is one of the this is one of the good things Disney's has the one done golden with Star nugget. Wars. Yeah, well, I like. There's it. been some other golden nuggets. Rogue One was really good. I've heard yeah, yeah, Andor yeah. is amazing. Yeah. Andor is good. Andor is awesome. Yeah, uh, I, yeah. I didn't like Boba Fett that much. Yeah, I yeah, did. I did, I did like the Obi Wan series. Uh, so did I. I People did didn't like, like it. I, I loved it. I liked. I thought it, it was great. I yeah. thought from start to finish, I enjoyed it quite a bit. Yeah, it's because everyone's got. If if it's not their vision of an Obi Wan story, if it's not exactly what's played out in their heads, they don't like it. Yeah, they don't want to see anything different. They want the story that they've been building. And there's a reason that these fucking nerds don't have jobs in Hollywood writing stories. It's because we no one wants to see those shitty stories. My yeah. biggest thing with the Obi Wan series, however, did was it have Henry the, Cavill in no, it? No, 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 no. The it was the, it was the production. It was a lot of lazy like camera work, a lot of lazy directing, just certain things like what? choreography. Wow, I didn't feel like that at all, and I'm always on the it's look it's for that. it's small moments like just like the little things of like oh he's walking through a hangar with this little girl under his cloak and nobody everybody's just like walking by who oh, no no big deal and just i, I get, little, I get little that things. aspect those little things like it, that they just they're in every on. episode but though. i think the overall arching theme of kenobi was was very well yeah. done i enjoyed the there was good cinematic moments it. of like the fights uh, and i'm right, so and then Vader with the four because it was just like the vader comic books which i loved yeah and he just rips the ship down with all that power. And I'm just like, those were the moments I love. Well, I'm someone that's easily taken out of a story, too. And I was never taken out of a story by anything of the camera work or anything like that. Yeah. So I, I think just, it was mostly choreography for me. Oh, I choreography like, of the fight? The fight? There was one fight where uh, it was the when the girl that was like behind like the enemy line, she was like working for the rebels, but was an imperial officer. And she just goes and like grabs one of the stormtroopers' heads and like head butts them together and they both fall over. It's just like it looked a little goofy. Well, well that's Star Wars. The, yeah, that <laughs> is Star Wars. Yeah, the only issue a, I had was the very rhythm. cartoony chasing of princess leia yes. through the woods yes that to me i was like yeah oh, that, that but that, that was the was first episode bad. yeah that yeah. was the first yeah. episode and that's flea was flea yeah and he's like <laughs> yes doing this the whole time i'm like i Come had on. to go and look to see if flea was in it that was part like, was bad and that did scare that? me i'm like oh god is this gonna be bad but it got much better it got way that. better yeah. Yeah. and the fucking we're getting way down the road, but Vader yeah. with his half his face torn off. That was really him cool. Him being so evil. When we saw that, yeah. I wanted much more Anakin. We saw Ahsoka with one half and then yeah, Kenobi for the other half, so which cool. I love that they tied that in. It was really awesome. Sorry, that. I did not like Boba Fett that much. I was one of the yeah. ones that And I understand like that. that. Uh, I have a soft spot in my, my heart for Boba Fett because I love him. I've got him tattooed on my body. So do I, and that's why I didn't like that movie very much because okay. I didn't think it did him yeah. service <laughs> at all. Yeah. If you know the character, you know that's not a Boba Fett show I'm all. I'm an awesome opposite star wars fan where it's like i'm rooting for everything so hard that like yeah, i want it to be stan. good i want it to be good <laughs> yeah, yeah. You, yeah but you man just, those, just, that new trilogy was trash and i will admit but it but you gotta be able to awful. you have to be able to criticize yeah. the things you like too right yeah. yeah uh but i like the mandalorian the mandalorian is like the both that show to me yes. you know he's yeah for sure and i think grogu gets a little more powerful in this one <sighs> I can't wait to watch well, because he's been trained. I definitely by Luke. have not seen it yet. No, I've never seen it. No, no, never, never. All right. Here it is. The Mandalorian season three official trailer. I definitely did not watch this during fall. Our people no, are scattered like stars in the galaxy. What are we? What do we stand for? Being a Mandalorian is not just learning about how to fight. Ooh. <laughs> I love this new show. I love the so cooing. I know how to navigate yeah. the galaxy. That's such so a that sick way, ship. You'll never it be is. lost. The Naboo ship. Yeah. Yeah. I love it, dude. The cruisers are sweet. I'm going this to Mandalore. So that I may be forgiven. And they're, for going, to they're going to Mandalore. I'm so excited for Holy that. Holy shit. This is the way. This is the way. 
There's something dangerous happening out there. Nice. And by the time it becomes big enough for you to act, it'll be too late. Oh my God. Hang on, kid. Yeah, boy, Grogu. So, How can you not be excited for that? Let's go, dude. You know what's great about that? It's coming man? out soon. It's coming out in one month. Yeah, it's coming out one month. We got to do. I, I we might that have to do finally go and fucking bring back our TV Tuesdays. Yeah, go to Mandalore. How have we not been there yet? It's we haven't. Insane, we haven't but, at uh, all. I'm very excited. I am really stoked to see if they actually do the whole like uniting the Mandalorians again. They gotta do their teasing. It looks so like, yeah. fucking Grogu cool. Grogu looking a little more powerful. Yeah. Have Mando uh, be the king of Mandalore. And season three, eight episodes again, uh, starting March first. I wonder if they're going to do the kind of the same thing where they drop the first three episodes. That'd be preferable. <laughs> but with eight probably, episodes, maybe probably maybe not. two, maybe two episodes. Yeah, two would be two. nice. But uh, yeah, John Favreau right in the first episode as well. I can't. I think he wrote oh, all of them. I'm skeptical of it now. John <laughs> yeah, Favreau's done a terrible job with Star Wars. Oh, no. Yeah, no, I'm pumped about this. It's going to be awesome. Know, this is the one John, thing. John's incredible. This is the one thing keeping me in Star Wars. Oh, yeah, dude. I wish John Favreau would do what James Gunn is doing with DC and head the Star Wars. Well, I think that after Indiana Jones, Kathleen Kennedy's gone. I Yeah, they've talked about that before. And there's a lot of other like actual like big you know news sites or that Dave are picking Filoni up on too, it either both one. of them yeah screw it yeah both. you could do a combination but it's always got to be like a numbers guy and a creative guy which yeah. well I'll do three of them well now you got too many cooks in the kitchen yeah. there Jim. <laughs> do <laughs> 20 of them yeah opinions there yeah because yeah. yeah. you don't want you want one guy hitting it one guy knowing where the story's gonna go mm -hmm. you know you want a board members or figuring it out that's why the new trilogy sucks so bad they had no idea where it was going yeah you know what's so sad too is it's been three years since season two yeah that's crazy it's that's been that wild. long that's I, it feels like it too i might have to go through and just rewatch all the mandalorian just because it's so good and so much fun i know i totally but, forgot that talk about td directed a couple episodes did, of the yes. first of the yeah. first season yeah. Yeah. his last two episodes was it no i think it was it was just, the last one i know the last, last one, one yeah. yeah oh yeah Deborah Chow, of course, too. Yeah. And yes. Bryce Ellis Howard. She did great. Yeah, she did great in uh, Chapter 11, The Hyrus, which was the Mando episode. It was mm -hmm. awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I can't wait. That looks uh, that looks pretty exciting. Looks good. I wonder if they're going to be bringing on any, like, who's the new director. And be showing on. how Grogu escaped the Jedi Temple when yes. Anakin yes. was going Chop City. I know, silly. Chop City. <laughs> yeah, it's that not Chop Suey, cool. it's Chop City, <laughs> baby. Yeah. So, and they're going to show who someone protected Grogu. Mm -hmm. Who do you think it is? Fucking Yoda, Yoda himself. <laughs> yeah. You think so? It's gotta be you Yoda think it's going to be Yoda? I don't. I don't. Sense. I honestly don't think it. it Canically, it would make sense because he was fighting uh, oh, Sidious, Sidious at the time. Yeah, yeah, well, that's true. So he'd have like, race let, over. And let's, do it. let's think of the timeline though. When Anakin is at the, uh, you know, at, at the temple massacring everybody, where is Yoda at that po point in time? He's not at the temple. I know that's why it'd be hard for him to be at the temple because he's at the council. Yeah, because yeah. he he's he, he's going to confront Sidious yeah. when all that's going on. So he can't be two places at once, right? And it couldn't be Windu or anything like it that. It wouldn't be so Obi Wan either. No, it been Obi Wan. It could be just a random. Could be like Plo Koon or something like that. Maybe yeah, that'd be, be cool. It could be a random yeah. Jedi for sure. But so I mean, or it's because it's gonna be someone that sacrificed. What about this? Yeah. That what, died. Of, what about this? Randomly, Ahsoka just pops up. She'd be really young. No, she would actually. No, it, yeah, she would be past teenage years. Yeah, she, this is because be in the Clone Wars, it, it shows yeah. where she is after, uh, or like when Order sixty six happens. Interesting. It no. could be a so because she she is I, in Coruscant. Yeah, she's escape trying to escape because right. she's she been, would like, have outlawed. She wouldn't have been nearly powerful enough to take on. Yeah, she was hanging out that uh, hanging out with uh, what's his what's his face, that that girl in the last season. Yeah. yeah, and she would have known Anakin as well, but she could have never have taken him head on. No, I mean she yeah. would have. Uh, so I don't. I mean, she did in uh, 
Rebels. And Rebels. Well, but she had but to get she had fact. to get saved. Yeah. She was older too. Yeah, and she was older in Rebels. She, yeah, that's she was, yeah. This would have been right around when she was hanging. This would have yeah. been around Clone Wars. Yeah, so when she, she was when she was exiled. Yeah, so she might have been might have been a little and too young. And then accepted to back, but she was like well, she was Anna Gans. <laughs> right, she was yeah. Anna protege. Yeah. yeah. So it would. I, I uh, think. It, I think it may be just someone random that ends up, or just like one of the Jedi's or, that sits in the a, background. Yeah. Or a bunch of semi older Jedi Padawans. That maybe. Would be maybe. Teens. What if it's the 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 old old old? Uh, God, what's his name? Sibu Inu. What's Cibu his name? Inu. I think Master Master. <laughs> yeah, it's Ibu not going to be Inu or gonna, whatever. He died on Order 66, I thought. Oh, uh, but he could have saved before. <laughs> How cool would that have been? No, Which one is Anakin, Cebu Inu? Anakin kills them all after Order 66. Master, uh, oh my God, it's the old alien, the super. It's the guy with the long neck, right? You yeah. You mean the long head? Yeah, the long oh, head. Oh, the, the long, oh, okay. He's I the same you. race of the, the the people who make the clones. Oh, man, I can't remember. Oh, uh, the the uh, Kaminoans? Yes. I don't know. It's not going to be him. There's not going to be some random no. character that three people but know. I, no, because remember, he it was not random. He was frozen in uh, the Kenobi series. Remember, he was one of the Easter eggs. He was frozen. Oh, yeah, frozen. you're right. He was. It's uh, Taro uh, S- uh, Sinube. Sinube. Yeah, there yeah. we go. Not Sino Ibu. Uh, but, uh, maybe. Uh, yeah, Taro Sinube. Yeah, dude. That'd be, f- that'd be cool. Or what if they started tying it into the video games and they did like the... Um, Cal, uh, maybe Cal Kestis, yeah. or what if it was uh, Cal Kestis's master? I don't um, think they'll do. I mean, because that's because he has the exact same story of he was protected by a Jedi master. Yeah, uh, yeah, true. Well. So yeah, it would yeah. be the exact same yeah. thing. We're getting yeah. into a well, lot of Star Wars theory. We'll this leave is that deep lore, and I theory. promise you, yeah. none of these things will, will yeah. floor. It won't be yeah. any of that. It'll be something much. I just much am simpler. Excited for more space cowboys. Yes, this uh, is the guy I was thinking of, but he dies. Oh, yeah, he the, gets, yeah, that's uh, yeah, Kiari Kiari Mundi. Yeah, he gets shot down like a. Uh, dog right. in the Just street no one like a loser. <laughs> when then Plo, Plo Koon crashes his face. so yeah, lame on uh, Kato Namoidia so lame yeah they all die in the most un uncinematic ways yeah I know the you, uh, Brotherhood book the Kato Namodians that book is really really good it's one of my you, favorite yeah. Star Wars books of all did time did you ever see the outtakes of them practicing the fight between Sidious and like Kit Fisto you know one that only lasts like 30 seconds I don't even think it was 30 scenes, seconds. No. So originally that scene was super fucking long. Like, you know, should have been. He just walks up and stabs yeah. him. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it, it, Kit Fist, though, was supposed to be like one of yeah. the best. Uh, it was so embarrassing. So they have, yeah. I'll just try to send you the footage. They have like footage. It's not of the guy who's playing, but it's like the stuntman who's going to yeah. play him. And the, it's so fucking cool. Like the Why scene did they that cut it out? George Lucas. Idiot. <laughs> <laughs> but he is like. I love you, George. I'm just kidding. But Darth Sidious, he's brilliant. like whipping but... around and he's like doing like the tornado spin thing that he does it's so much fucking cool so much better than a well it just shows you immediately that he was like one of the best duelists of all yeah. time and he just hated doing it but in that one it just looks like he's in like he's like mr magoo he's like <laughs> tripping <laughs> and like snap and yeah. he's like yeah. i didn't see that coming i'm like you're a jedi master are you what <laughs> like, the hell is Sidious it just cuts it, through but, three of them like uh, butter, like just, butter. Whoop, whoop, it whoop, literally done. irritated me as a kid yeah, i'm like that those these are jedi well masters? it's so irritating when you watch clone wars and those guys are in a lot of clone uh-huh. wars and, and they are see what they yeah. Yeah. yeah and it's frustrating as all this, get though, out he had two lights here so yeah. he could go crazy. Yeah. He could go dual. Like it was irritating. so frightening. So irritating. Imagine being at a 13 year old watching that and me shaking my head. I like, know. That's is... when you know you, you messed up, right? Jeez. Uh all right. That's all, all right. we got. Yeah. That's a long one. It was a long one. Uh that is our reaction to the Mandalorian season three. If you guys like what you've seen here, please be sure to smash the like button, comment below, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell notifications. We drop videos here every single day. Thank you so much for watching and listening. My name is Mason Knight. That is Cash Krause. And until next time. Bye.